start to play. Jesus. I had trouble turning the mic on. He didn't want to unmute. So yeah, we're restarting this. After the issues I had last time, I wanted to just start fresh. Let's see how this goes. Let's see if I remember how to get all the stars. Which, I mean, I should. I watched so many people play it the past few weeks. Chow, you reached Princess Toadstool's castle via warp pipe. Using the controller as a piece of cake, press A to jump and B to attack. Press B to read signs, too. Use the control stick in the center of the controller to move Mario around. Now head for the castle. What if I want to read this? Princess Toadstool's castle is just as ahead. Bleh. What happened? <laughs> press A to jump, Z to crouch, and B to punch. Read a sign or grab something. Press B again to throw something you're holding. Let's go. Let's go see the Lakitu brothers. I say brothers, but there's only one. Good afternoon, the Lakitu bros here, reporting live from the outside of the princess's castle. Mario has just arrived on the scene and will be filming the action live as he enters the castle and pursues the missing power stars. It's seasoned cameraman. We'll be shooting from the recommended angle, but you can change the camera angle by pressing the C buttons. If you can't adjust the view any further, we'll buzz. To take a look at the surrounding stop and press C up. Press A to resume play. Switch camera modes with the R button. Sign, signs along the way will review these instructions. From now, reporting live, this has been the Lakitu Bros. Yahoo! Ow. Of course I knocked my head into the door. <laughs> Welcome. No one's home. Now scram. And don't come back. Gwa <laughs> ha what do you have to say, I don't remember what you had to say. Am I glad to see you? The princess and I and, well, everybody were all trapped inside the castle walls. Hello, my half. Bowser has stolen the castle stars and he's using their power to create his own, his own world in the paintings and walls. Please recover the power stars as you find them. You can use their power to open the doors that Bowser has sealed. There are four rooms on the first floor. Start in the one with the painting of Bomb Mom inside. It's the only room that Bowser hasn't sealed. When you collect eight power stars, you'll be able to open the door with the big star. The princess must be inside. Yahoo! Hopefully there won't be any issues today. Because I'd like to actually play this and not have to worry about that. How are you today? Wow, you're smack in the middle of the battlefield. You'll find the power stars that Bowser saw inside the painting worlds. First, talk to the bomb on buddy. Press B to talk, he'll certainly help you out. And so will his comrades in other areas. To read signs, stop, face them, and press B. Press A or B to scroll ahead. You can talk to the, some other characters by facing them and pressing B. Let's not talk to anybody yet. Let's go fight the bomb king. Ow. Of course, I did the sign. Are you kidding me? I did this last time too, where I just fell down. That's good to hear. Oh god. I can do some things. I can move around a little bit in Mario Bros. 64. Not better than anyone, but I can, I can still move. Just get up here and mess with this big ball mom guy. Ow. Also, you know what? I missed this last time because I forgot all about it. Let's do it this time. I'm the big bomb mom, lord of all blasting matter, king of kabooms, the world over. 
How dare you scare my scare? How dare you scale my mountain? By what right do you set foot on my imperial mountaintop? You may have eluded my guards, but you'll never escape my grasp. And you'll never take away my power, star. I hereby challenge you, Mario. If you want the star I hold, you must prove yourself in battle. Can you pick me up from the back and hurl me to this royal turf? I think that you cannot. I don't think I can either. <laughs> well, <laughs> that was my worst attempt ever at grabbing him. Oh, he's just gonna say the same thing, okay. But yeah, I, I can't believe that happened. Ow. Well, I did so well the first time I fought him. I want to throw you off. That was very, very, very quick. I just wanted to throw him off. He must fight with honor. It is against the royal rules to throw the king out of the ring. But it's okay for me to fly out of the ring. Got it. There we go, finally. I will say, I may be having trouble with this. I have more trouble with Bowser. Actually, I didn't know so he'd hurt me. What happens if I just do this? You know, I wasn't expecting to land in his arms. It, it's always satisfying to throw him off. There we go. What? What? Can it be that a pipsqueak like you has defused the bomb bomb king? You might be fast enough to ground me, but you'll have to pick up the pace if you want to take King Bowser by the tail. Methinks my troops could learn a lesson from you. Here's your star, as I promised, Mario. If you want to see me again, select the star from the menu for now. Farewell. I will say, even though I'm starting this over, we should be able to get to where uh, I was last time really quickly. You recovered one of the stolen power stars. Now you can open some of the sealed doors in this castle. Try the princess's room on the second floor, and the room with the painting of the Wops Fortress on floor one. Bowser's troops are still gaining power, so you can't give up. Save us, Mario. Keep searching for stars. You know what? I want to go do the uh, slide. I always enjoy doing the slide. I'm surprised I didn't hit a wall there. Yeah, he is. Reacting to the star power, the door opens slowly. I, uh... I've just... I've never been good at fighting Bowser, because I can't get these the throw down. I apparently can't get in this painting, either. They really are. What does this say? Does this give you a hint at the, uh... Time... Star? Open the princess to the little secret slide. There's a star hidden here that Bowser couldn't find. The slide press forward to speed up and pull back to slow down. If you slide really fast, you'll win. Yeah, it does. You'll win that star. Also, is there any speed difference between belly sliding and butt sliding? Because I honestly have no idea if there is. I always feel like I have less control whenever I'm belly sliding. So I can see it being a bit faster. But I just don't know. Are you serious? Are you... <laughs> Are you serious right now? That doesn't get me the star. I ha it has to be 20.9 or whatever. Dang. I've always wondered that, but I've never actually tested it or anything. What does this say? Mario, my castle is in great peril. I know that Bowser is, is the cause, and I know that only you can stop him. The doors in this castle that have been sealed by Bowser can be opened only with power stars. The star power, ugh. 
but there are secret paths in the castle. Paths that Bowser hasn't found. One of those paths is in this room, and it holds one of the castle's secret stars. Find that secret star, Mario. It'll help you on your quest. Please, Mario. You have to save us. Retrieve all of the power stars in the castle and free us from this awful prison, please. I can't believe it was that close. But I mean, it happens. Let's go with that belly slide. I think I'm already doing better, but I don't know if it's the speed. I think it's just the turning. I think we got it this time. Yeah. Oh god. I wasn't expecting to go sliding that far towards the wall. That was a bit insane. You recovered three power stars. Now you can open any door with the three on its star. You can come and go from the open courses as you please. The enemies ahead are even meaner, so be careful. Also, I don't know if you noticed, but reading is hard sometimes. <laughs> English is also hard sometimes. We'll just read one of these right now. You have to master three important jumping techniques. First, try the triple jump. Run fast and jump three times. One, two, three. If you time the jump strike, you'll hop, skip, and then jump really high. Let's go for distance. With long jump run, press Z to crouch, then A to jump really far. To do the wall kick, press A to jump at a wall, and then jump again when you hit the wall. Got that? Triple jump, long jump, wall kick. Practice, practice, practice. You don't stand a chance without them. I will say, even though, like, uh, Mario Sunshine, wall jumps were easier, I feel like it was better with them being the way they were in Mario 64. Hey Mario, is it true that you beat the big bomb? -omb? Cool. You must be strong and pretty fast. So how about so how fast are you anyway? Fast enough to beat me, Koopa the Quick? I don't think so. Just try me. How about a race to the mountaintop where the big bomb -omb was? What do you say? When I say go, let the race begin. Ready? Go. You know, I'm gonna do the wall jump. Ow. Oh god. You know, I thought I had it. Mario 64's jumps are really good. I love the, mo the movement in this game. Even if I don't play it all that often. So, uh, besides the last stream, the last time I played Mario 64 would probably be like five or six years before this. I think so, at least. But yeah, I, I don't play the game enough. I just play it occasionally. Yeah, we did it. Now I guess we just sit here and wait for Koopa the not so quick. Where even is he? He's, he's so slow. I feel like we've been waiting here forever. What do you want? What are you doing? Oh, oh, whoa. You really are fast. A human blur. Here you go. You've won it. Fair and square. Give me that star. It's mine. If I can even land on it. Let's see what that other sign says now, and then we'll get whatever the next star is. I don't even remember what star is next. You can return to the castle's main hall at any time from the painting worlds where the enemies live. Press stop, stand still, or just stop, stand still, and press start to pause the game. Then select takes a course. You don't have to collect all the power stars in one course before going on to the next. Return later when you're more experienced to pick up difficult ones. 
Whenever you find a star, a hand for finding the next one will appear on the course's start screen. You can, however, collect any of the remaining stars next. You don't have to recover the one described by the hint. A friend of mine actually said the same thing last time I did this. And I was like, yeah, I'll do it again. Shoot to the island? Yeah. We're peace loving bomb moms, so we don't use cannons. But if you'd like to blast off, we don't mind. Help yourself. We'll prepare all the cannons in this course for you to use. Bon voyage. So, uh, time for that kitty face again. Ready for blast off? Come on, hop into the cannon. You can reach the star on the floating island by using four, uh, using the four cannons. Use the control stick to aim, then press A to fire. If you're handy, you can grab onto trees for poles to land. What do you have to say? Thank you, Mario. The big bomb mom is nothing but a big dud now. But the battle for the castle has just begun. Other enemies are holding the power stars. If you recover more stars, you can open new doors that lead to new worlds. My bomb mom buddies are waiting for you. Be sure to talk to them. They'll set up cannons for you. There's more signs! But not now. I do like reading and seeing what the things say. I see you, kitty head. Kitty face. Let's go to you. You might take me to the right. Oh god. I aimed up too high. Well, I mean. We're on the right path. Give me that cannon. Also, I didn't know what that explosion was, but it was the, uh. What should we call it? The water balloon thing. From the cannons. There we go. That kitty face is so nice. It just tells you exactly where to go. If only the kitty face was there to guide you in every cannon. But apparently it's not. Also, I think this is red coins. So let's go for that 100 coins. Since I know that you can spin around those poles now. I think this just tells you how to break these blocks. Also, reading signs are hard. To read a sign, stand in front of it and press B like you did just now. When you want to talk to a Koopa Trooper or other animal, stand right in front of it. Please recover the stars that were stolen by Bowser in this course. Yeah, I think I can do that. You can punch enemies to knock them down. Press A to jump, B to punch. Press A, then B to kick. To pick something up, press B too. To throw something you're holding, press B again. Oh god. I will say, I do always have trouble grabbing things in this game. Because you have to be so precise to grab things and read signs and talk to people as well. And I am not good with precision. Come here, you little bomby. Yeah, I think we don't even need to use those coins in that ring up top. Whenever we can just uh, run around those poles. And yes, I do plan on running around the uh, chain chomp pole again. Because I mean, why wouldn't I? It worked once. It can work again. So I hope it can. Also, I think I got these bombs. Come here, little Goomba. I almost forgot what it's called. How do you even forget the name of Goombas? I mean, really, come on. They're in every Mario game. Alright, where are you? Uh, please come down. The hardest part. The hardest part is getting you. Yeah. Oh god. I cannot get on them. There we go. I of course won't do it yet because I would like to get as much as I can while on the turtle shell. Because I mean, it's Koopa shell surfing. Who doesn't want to surf on a Koopa shell? I can't even speak. To be fair, I was never able to to begin with. 
Oh god, I feel like I'm going too fast. Come on, get up. Also, I think the bomb might have exploded behind me. Ah, That didn't last too long. I don't know how long I'm going to stream. I would like to get a good chunk of the stars today, though. No visitors allowed, by decree of the Egg Bomb Bomb. I shall never surrender my stars, for they hold the power of the castle in their glow. They were a gift from Bowser, the Koopa King himself, and they live well hidden within my realm. Not a whisper of their whereabouts shall leave my lips. Oh, alright, perhaps one hint. Heed the star names at the beginning of the course, the Big Bomb Bomb. But yeah, I have no idea how long I'll stream. It's just however long I feel like, honestly. But I'll probably be here for at least four hours. Yeah, it should, that, yeah, at least four hours. Ow. Unless I somehow got every single star in four hours. Or three hours, and then it'll be like, alright, well, I'm done. I didn't even see where that, that coin went. I can hear it moving, but it's like I didn't even see it. Chirk. Why do I feel like there's actually another blue... No, there's no blue coins here, besides the, uh, what's-his-face. Koopa Troopa. We get 25 coins out of this, I think. As long as we get the big chain chomps. I might actually have to, uh, fire through some of those coins if I want this. I hope not, but we'll see. This just tells you about ground pounding. The shadowy- oh, no it doesn't. The shadowy star in front of you is a star marker. When you collect all eight red coins, the star will appear. I'm trying to think of where enough coins would be because I've already forgotten. My memory is honestly bad. Now the spooky one. Because I mean, why not go ahead and get the spooky one out of the way? Ow. Dang, I'm not going to get it this time. Oh god. There we go. That's what I was looking for. I just ran right into your face. Ah, there it is. Give me that last one. That was a lot harder than the last time. Beware of chain chop. Extreme danger. Get close and press C up for a better look. Scary, huh? See the red coin on top of the stake? When you collect eight of them, a power star will appear in the meadow across the bridge. Please don't touch me. Ooh. Oh, wait, I know where some more stuff is. Thankfully, we're gonna get back to full health. After that encounter with the uh, chain chomp. I don't know if I'm going to need the lives, but might as well pick it up. Also, this only keeps this open for this instance of the level, right? So, like, if I leave the level and come back, that'll be closed again. That'll stay open as long as I don't get a star or leave the level. You were a little too close. Also, where's the last red coin? Is it on that island? I think it was on the island. I'm not 100% sure on that. Does this have anything in it? Nope. Ow. What do you have to say? You can grab onto the edge of a cliff or a ledge with your fingertips and hang down from it. 
drop from the edge, either you press the control stick in the direction of Mario's back or press the Z button. If you get up onto the ledge, either press up on the control stick or press A as soon as you grab the ledge to quickly climb up. Even though I don't think it said quickly climb up, it just said quickly. I'm just like, I don't, I don't know. I always don't, I never understand that weird slide. Where you just slide while you're crouched like that. I guess you're going down a small slope when that happens? Well... I thought I hit jump. Apparently not. Oh god. I knew whenever I made that jump I did a bad. I think I can do this. Yeah. I mean, it might have been just as fast to go down and run around, but I didn't want to do that. I'm a little stubborn. I'm going to need 10 of those coins. Are you serious? I mean, 10 shouldn't be too bad. The only problem is getting the star. Oh boy. I think we can get it though. Just need five more. And I'm pretty sure I have to go up there to get them now. At this point. Because I missed a couple. And I'm pretty sure I got all the enemies. Actually, I don't think know if I got these guys. Oh. I need to not get too many up top. If I can just get a couple, I'm good. Oh god. That was too low. That was way too low. Also, I don't know if you care about this. I've been really excited. Uh, that, there's that rumor going around right now that Spyro's Remastered Trilogy is getting announced today. And I hope it's true. I love the original Spyro the Dragon. Well, I love the original trilogy. And I would love to see them updated. Wait, did I seriously not get all the Goombas? Oh god. I can't believe I missed that. Oh well. I really want to play them again. And to be fair, I do want to stream them at some point. You've collected 100 coins. Mario gains more power from the castle. Do you want to save? Of course. No, I should have saved one of the red coins over here to be the last one. Whoa. I do not want to be hit by you. Of course I do that again. What do you say? Hold Z to crouch and slide down a slope, or press Z while in the air to ground pound. If you stop crouch and jump, you'll do a backward somersault. Got that? There's more. Crouch and then jump to do a long jump, or crouch and walk to... never mind. Really? The Spyro games are fantastic. I absolutely love them. I want to play the Crash Remastered Trilogy too, but I don't have anything to play it on at the moment. But maybe one day. Maybe one day I'll get a chance to play it. Wait, why am I leaving? It's not time yet. Mario wings to the sky. I, I'm sure there's a way to get that without the wing cap, but I'm going to wait and get the wing cap for that because, I mean, I really don't want to deal with that without the wing cap. Oh god. I'm glad I actually hit it. Oh god, I can't see. 
I was hoping maybe I could do it without being able to see, but... Ugh. That was cutting it a little too close. Also, you notice that I jump around a lot in this game. I wonder <laughs> how bad it's going to be for me whenever I get to the later levels. Because I just want to move fast. You recovered eight of the power stars. Now you can open the big door with the big star. But Bowser is just ahead. Can you hear the princess calling? You know what? I actually want to fight Bowser first. Let's go do that. I thought there was a way to get it without the wing cap, but I guess not. Reacting to the star power, the door opens. The door slowly opens. Come on, let's go. You get to see how bad I am at Bowser's fight. <laughs> You've stepped right into my trap, just as I knew you would. I warn you, friend. Watch your step. Oh, God. You didn't see that. I hope you didn't see that, at least. Oh, God, that was bad. Yes, I do remember this. Well, <laughs> there might have been a reason why I said the jumping could be bad for me. I do think I can get this, though. Oh, my God. I cannot believe I didn't die that time. Oh, okay. I'm glad you didn't see that. Oh god. You know, I thought I could make it. I can make it. I'll just go the I'll just go around. I'll go the normal way. If this is an extra life, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Can I get it? Yes I can. Oof. Oh god. I almost missed that red coin. Come on. I am kind of... Oh god. I wasn't expecting to die again. Apparently I'm also bad at the Bowser stages themselves. I'll wait for that to go, and then I'll step on the switch. Oof. Oh my god. I need to stop being so risky in this level. This might it's gonna be my downfall. To be fair, it has been my downfall a few times. I'll wait. I'm not so impatient that I can't wait a second. I'm not gonna get that life this time though. There we go. That's what I was waiting on. Can I make this jump? Yes, I can. Whew. That could have been really bad, though. Oh god. 
I know that's an extra life, but I'm not going to go for it. You know, I am doing a lot of stupid things and not paying for them. I think I need to just not try anything else stupid. Get out of here. I can't even punch the Goomba. <laughs> I, I'm not good at punching. I am not good at getting close to the enemies in this. Here we go, that's what I needed. Long jump is not what I'm gonna do here. As much as I wanted a long jump. I've done enough stupid stuff on this level. Oh god. I would have been so upset if I would have died right there. Come on, Mario jump. Did not mean wall jump there, but it worked. Whew! Wow, another power star. Mario gains more courage than the power of the castle. Do you want to save? You bet. Now, expect this fight to last 30 minutes. Mario, it's Peach. Please be careful. Bowser is so wicked. He will try to burn you with his horrible flame breath. Run around behind and grab him by the tail with the B button. Once you grab him, swing him around in great circles. Rotate the control stick to go faster and faster. The faster you swing him, the farther he'll fly. Use the C button to look around, Mario. You have to throw Bowser into one of the bombs in the four corners. Aim well and press B again to launch Bowser. Good luck, Mario. Our fate is in your hands. It may be in my hands, but... I, like I said, I've never been good at this. Tough luck, Mario. Princess Toad still isn't here. <laughs> Go ahead, just try to grab me by the tail. You'll never be able to swing me around. A wimp like you won't throw me out of here. Never. Ha. I might be able to grab his tail, but that's about it. I'm gonna go for that one over there. Let's just show you how bad I really am. Well. <laughs> completely missed it. Oh god. I'll be able to get closer now, so there's that. But I still don't know if I'll be able to hit it. Uh, oh, that actually hit. I didn't think it was going to hit. Alright, it's not 30 minutes apparently. Urgh. I was a bit careless. This is not as I had planned. But I still hold the power of the stars, and I still have Peach. <laughs> You'll get no more stars from me. I'm not finished with you yet, but I'll let you go for now. You'll pay for this later. Bowser, you can't do anything to me. I, I just know I'm going to have trouble throwing you. Especially in the next one, oh god. Congratulations! We beat Bowser. How many stars do we need for the wing cap? We can't do it yet, apparently. You know, I know Womp's Fortress is next, but I really want to go to the Snowland. Cool, cool mountain. Reacting to the star power, the door slightly opens. This is like one of my favorite worlds. To be fair, I love snow. So it's just like... Why not? Why not go here and have fun? Snow Mountain Summit. Watch for slippery conditions. Please enter the cottage first. Santa Claus is the only one who can go down a chimney. Come on in, cabin proprietor. We'll go for the, uh, 
100 coin star every time we go for our red coins. Welcome to the snow slide. Hop on. To speed up, press forward on the control stick. To slow down, pull back. Come on, give me that blue coin. And I don't need it yet. Still nice. I always love these slides too. Oh god, I almost died. Also, I really kind of think I should just go ahead and get the uh, coin star because w this slide is just so good. Oh yeah. This level's fantastic. You know what? I'm honestly going to go ahead and just go for the uh, coin star. Then we'll hop back down here and pick up the, uh, oh, oh, we're not talking to you yet. We'll hop back down here and pick up that star. Because, I mean, why not? The slide gives you so many coins, it's so ridiculous. To be fair, I think every single slide gives you a lot of coins. There's only two for the main levels, right? That you would even need to worry about getting coins on. Also, I do not know the warp that well for this place. Like, I know where it's at, but I always have trouble actually getting the warp to, to uh, trigger. Warning, cold, cold crevasse below. We don't need to worry about that. At all. Oh, give me that one single coin. Thank you. Oh, wait a minute. There's blue coins in this level. So yeah, this shouldn't take too long. Thankfully. Oh god. Well. Will we even need them? No, but I mean, they're next. Or not. I'll just go this way. You give me three. Just please don't drop them off. You dropped a coin off. You butt. There's a coin right here though, so... We should probably activate the cannon while we're up here too. You've collected 100 coins, Mario. <laughs> You've collected 100 coins. Mario gains more power. In the castle, do you want to save? Of course. Yeah, let's do this. Aha! I wonder if I could have actually long jumped all the way down. Dang it! Dang it! I can't believe that happened. I couldn't get around the tree. And I was too scared to just jump off of it. Like, I could have probably jumped and landed on that platform still, but I just didn't do it. Come on, belly slide to victory. Probably not the best idea, but especially whenever the camera's not turning. There we go. Oof. Slide backwards on your belly the entire way it does not seem the safest way to do this. Oh god. I mess up one thing, or one time, and then it's just like, I can't. I can't even. We got it this time. I'm not gonna dive off and screw myself like I did. Like, I think I could have done it after doing that, but I'm not gonna risk it again. Because, I wait, I can just do this. Plus I can get extra lives. We're one extra life because I missed that one. Oh, so you can ball jump up here, can't you? Let's see, can you? Do 
Yes, you can. Oh, there's no real point in doing that other than getting your life, I don't think, but... You can do it. Also, uh, since we're about to do it, I will be doing the second race with the penguin after I beat the game. Like, I know there's no point in doing it, but I'd like to race the penguin again when he's faster. Little penguin lost. You mean the, the easiest one? You mean the one I'm gonna screw up now because I said that? Okay, let's see. Let's go around this way. And we can dive off the mountain. Haha! <laughs> Super fast and easy. You found my precious, precious baby! Where have you been? How can I ever thank you, Mario? Oh, I do have this, Star. Here, take it with my eternal gratitude. Now let's bring her to the other penguin that she doesn't care about. She has, this penguin looks nothing like me. That's not my baby. She looks nothing like me. Her parents must be worried sick. Take care of it. Because, I mean, there's no other big penguins here. So, somebody should take care of it. I mean, I'm not staying here, so I can't really take care of the baby. Plus, I don't really want to. Actually, I wonder if this one could be the parent. Hey, hey! Mario, buddy. How's it going? Step right up. You look like a fast sledding kind of guy. I know speed when I see it. Yes, sir, Reed. I'm the world champion sledder, you know. What do you say? How about a race? Ready? Go. I'm gonna belly slide too if you're gonna belly slide. I need a good place to belly slide again. Oh god. There's no straightaways. I need to feel comfortable enough to do this. And then I just fly off the edge. Dang it. We can beat this penguin. We can do it. We've done it before, we can do it again. I wish there was a way I could start this. Like, uh... As I'm in mid-animation for sliding. I'm coming for you. You can't beat me, Penguin Buddy. So I don't think you can. Oh god. I was not expecting to bounce a little bit, but I did. I think I can beat you. You're not gonna catch me now, actually. Oh god. Whew. That was a lot spookier than it needed to be. Holy crap. What are you doing, Penguin Buddy? You broke my record. Unbelievable. I knew that you were the coolest. Now you've proven that you're also the fastest. I can't award you a gold medal, but here, take this star instead. You've earned it. Give it to me. It's mine. Here we go. I think we're doing pretty good on stars. I've gotten 13 in almost an hour. Can I get 15 in an hour? I think I can. I just gotta remember where all the uh, red coins are. There's a few that I had trouble finding last time. Also, if you hear that, somebody outside on a motorcycle. I don't know whose motorcycle that is, but... Yeah, that's the thing. 
think that's the one I had trouble finding last time. If I'm not mistaken. Ow. Get off that tree. There's no uh, red coin. Okay, there's no red coin on that. I just gotta make it all the way down. Ugh. Oh yeah, there's that last one. We don't need to worry about getting the uh, red, that red coin until the end. Haha. <laughs> Who even deals with the snowman on the bridge? Not me. Mainly because they're kind of butts. Also, I didn't realize I landed in that. Also, we didn't read this last time. Egad! My baby! Have you seen my baby? She's the most precious, precious baby in the world. They say she has my beak. I just can't remember where I left her. Let's see, I stopped for herring and ice cubes and I... Oh, I just don't know. She's panicking. He's panicking? I don't know if that's the male or female penguin. I just don't know. Oh god. That could have been bad. That could have been real bad. The question is though... Can I make that one jump again? Ow. Dang it, dang it. I'm having trouble just getting up here now. I need to stop running towards the edge. Warning, cold, cold crevasse below. I hit the jump button, but am I going to make it? Ho ho, I made it again! I can't believe I'm consistently getting that jump. Also, I'm pretty sure I started like shortly after 1. So we should be able to actually get 15 in an hour. Snowman has lost his head. We're definitely getting it because this one's not that hard. I need a good head on my shoulders. Do you know of anybody in need of a good body? Please, I'll follow you if you do. Come on. Like, this isn't that bad. It's literally just slide behind the, uh, the snowman's head. If I'm not mistaken, it's, that's all there really is to it. Yeah. I cannot interact with the snowman. There we go. Perfect! What a great new body. Here, this is a present for you. I'm sure to warm up to this. I'm, I'm sure to warm you up. Is it possible that star melted the snowman's body originally? And it was just holding onto it for some reason? That seems really weird. We did it. But can we get this one now? So, I wanted to try something here. Larry, uh, she uh, somehow fell off the map and landed on the underside for this star. But I'm just like, I don't know, even know how you managed to do this. Okay, so I know where it's at now. But, uh, I don't know how I'm gonna, I don't know how I'm gonna do that. I don't know how she did it. But I want to try it. Because that was a really cool way to get down there. And I mean, who even needs a cannon? I almost had it. I think I almost had it. She did it and I'm just like, that looks awesome. I want to do that. 
I thought it might be a speedrun move. Ow. Facing away from where you want to land. Hold back when falling. Okay. Dang it. I think I need to jump from the slide before uh, I fall off. I'm pretty sure it's what I need to do. Oh god. Alright, let's see. Come on, start the slide. Dang it. I didn't get the jump off. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure it is jump too. Because you'd have to jump to get out of the sliding animation so you don't dive. At least that's how I see it. Okay, I just need to do it from farther back. I almost had it. I was right there. That was super close. I can do this. I can definitely do this. Dang it, I didn't hit jump. I don't remember the last time I ever got a game over in Mario 64. This might have... Uh, either I'm gonna make it this time, or it's gonna be game over. Crap. Haha! I did it. This just tells you about wall kicks, because it's like, hey, you need to wall kick. Remember that tricky wall kick jump? It's a technique you'll have to master in order to reach high places. Use it to jump from wall to wall. Press the control stick in the direction you want to bounce in a, to gain momentum. Practice makes perfect. I can't believe I actually made that. Haha. I can't believe I didn't have to worry about getting a game over. I was I was not expecting to waste all my lives on that though. Oh crap! I need the double, uh, not double. I need triple for that. I need triple jump to reach that. Oh crap! I did get the triple jump, but it was too early. Crap! I don't remember having this much trouble last time. Probably a stupid idea. Yeah, stupid idea. I'm gonna try it again, because I mean, why not? What's the worst that can happen? I don't get it. So we actually completed uh, course four. Completed course four and one. We're not doing too bad. Stop and press Z to crouch and press A to do a high backward somersault. To perform a slide somersault, run, do a sharp U-turn and jump. You can catch lots of air with both, both jumps. I like the somersault jump more. Thank you. I'm surprised I got that close to game overing. Oh wait, we didn't complete world one. We gotta do this first. And then we can complete world one. Welcome to the wing cap course. Step on the red switch at the top of the tower in the center of the rainbow ring. When you trigger the switch, all the red blocks will find you find will become solid. Try out the wing cap. Do the chill jump to take off and press C to land. Pull back on the control stick to, do, to go up and push forward to nose down. Just as you would in flying an airplane. I've always had trouble with this. Like, the wing cap is so awesome. But I feel like... I don't have much control over it. That's just me though, I'm sure other people have better control of it than I do. Yeah. Well, we still technically haven't beaten World 1 yet. We'll be getting it soon. And I am by no means great at this game. 
Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oof. You've stepped on the wing cap switch. Bring the wing cap, you can soar through the sky. Now wing cap blo now wing caps will pop up out of the red blocks you find. But you got to save, yes. I think I can get the lower uh, red coins. But I think that's it. I don't think I could get anything higher than that. There we go. Can you actually gain height and continue to gain height with the wing cap? Because if you can, I've never been able to manage that. Something I would like to be able to do, but I don't even know if it's possible. I know you can gain a little bit of height, but I feel like I lose that way too fast. Hi, Amanda. How are you today? Now we forget this Finnish world one. Also, we didn't. Oh, wait, we did surf on the turtle shell. And I can't believe I just landed on that. You know, we don't need that wing cat block. We'll go get the other one. How are you today, Amanda? Dipping and pulling up. I get maybe. Let's see. We get the, the kitty face. It's very consistent aiming for the kitty face. And I think this happened last time. I think I might have mentioned it last time, or I didn't do it last time. One of the two. You aim right in the middle and you don't hit anything, right? And Mario just does the rest for you. Even though I missed that. I'm doing fantastic. Hey, Debrin. How you doing? But yeah, I'm fantastic, and I'm glad you're doing alright, Mando. Are you doing well? I wish I didn't miss that one star, or not the star of that coin, though. I've never actually gotten that in one go. It's always taken me multiple attempts. For me, at least. Save and continue. So... Womp's Fortress or... Uh, Jolly Roger Bay. Yeah, it is. I don't remember if I asked. How are you doing, Debrin? Uh, Durba? <laughs> Durbin? <laughs> Jesus, names are hard. Well, for me, words are hard in general, so... Oh, Toad. The names of the stars are also hits for finding them. They are displayed at the beginning of each course. You can collect the stars in any order. You won't find some stars, enemies, or items unless you select a specific star. After you collect some stars, you can try another course. We're all waiting for your help. Alright, Womp's Fortress? Let's do this. What was- oh. I- I'm sorry, Durbin. I'm sorry. I've always bad with names. Wait, what? <laughs> oh yeah, I'm doing fantastic. Oh, oh, did you? I must have missed that, crap. Don't mind me, I'm a butt. Hello, the Lacty Bros, cutting in with a live update on Mario's progress. He's about to learn a technique for sneaking up on enemies. The trick is this. He has to walk very slowly in order to walk quietly. And wrapping up filming techniques reported on earlier, you can take a look around the, using C right and C left. Press C down to view the action from a distance. As you can tell, words are hard for me in general. I just do casual. I just play games casually. But I always try to get everything in them. When you can't move the camera any farther, the buzzer will sound. This is Lag2 Bro signing off. Really? That's fun. 
my half. That's fine. Ooh, what does this say? Actually, we'll read that later. We just need to get up here and beat up the womp, the womp guy, the big womper. Oh god. Oh god, I can't believe I did this. Who even screws this up? I mean, apparently me, but who even does this? And I'll call you Durbin. I want to call you by your name. It's just, I am an idiot sometimes. Actually, most of the time, but still. Yes, give me that. Also, I know the trick for fighting these guys. Press A and B. Oh, you're talking about the beat up the uh, piranha plants? It makes me so mad. We build your houses, your castles, we pave your roads, and still you walk all over us. Do you ever say thank you? No. Well, you're not going to wipe your feet on me. I think I'll crush you just for fun. Do you have a problem with that? Just try to pound me, wimp. Huh. Really? Push A and B. Oh god. Oh wait. Yeah. Oh god. I messed that up. I mean, I still got him, but I messed that up a little bit. Can you even get the 100 coin star on this first attempt? No. Crushed again. I'm just a stepping stone after all. I won't gravel or grovel. Here, you win. Take this with you. I feel like we're doing pretty good on star collecting. You know, I have no idea. And they do it pretty fast. Like, they do it ridiculously fast. They're already done. I just ran through that sign. I can't even read it. I'm sleeping because I'm sleepy. I don't like being disturbed. Please walk quietly. Well, we'll mess with them whenever we need these uh, 100 coin star. The shadowy star in front of you is a star marker. When you collect all eight red coins, the star will appear here. Is there a warp here? Or is there just like a life in this little flower bed? I thought there was like a life or something. And I don't know if there's a warp in every level. But I kind of wouldn't doubt it if there was. Oh god, that could have been bad. Oh f Nobody saw that. There are special caps in the red, green, and blue blocks. Step on the switches and the hidden courses to activate the cap blocks. Wait, there is a warp in this level? Really? I didn't realize you could actually get all 100 coins in the first part of this level. I can save myself sometimes. Let's see what this has to say. The path is narrow here. Easy does it. No one is allowed on top of the mountain. And if you know it's good for you, you won't wake anyone who's sleeping. Move slowly. Tread lightly. One of the flowers. Okay. I'll have to try it again. Soon. Not right this second, though. Bam. I like how easy it is to take these guys out. Because I know this was not intended. At least I don't think it would be intended. That you could just go through them. And I will check the flower after we finish this. There might be a specific point in the flower too. And I just don't know where it is. I wonder where it warps you to. No, I'll wait. I'll wait. As much as I don't want to wait, I'll do it. Give me that star. Actually, I wonder...
Hmm. I'm actually curious about something. I'm gonna try this. Shoot to the wild blue. Also, we don't even need a cannon. I know the thingy here. No warpies. At least not yet. It has to be like a specific point of the flower bed. Or maybe I'm just not waiting long enough. I'm, I'm not gonna go for it right now. It's not there? Okay. Durbin, do you know where it's at? Oh god. Why do I feel like it's in the water? Like in this ring. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about that. At least not right now. Let's get this and then I'm gonna try the thing I was thinking about. Also, that cannon for this star scares me. That's why I don't like using it. Go to the ramp over the three holes where the green block is in one corner. Okay. I can do that. We'll see. You know, we didn't even try this flower bed. You know, let's go up to this corner. Also, we're... This is the red coins. We're not gonna go for that star just yet. I didn't save it that time. Game over. There's that game over. <laughs> Dang it, I wasn't expecting to honestly get a game over. Also, who even needs a cannon whenever you can jump off walls? I'm just glad that it doesn't really penalize you for dying in this game. But yeah, I do have an idea for something. And I really, really, really want to try it out. Also because I'm very bad at not being careful. I'm just going to go up this way. Whoa, whoa, oh. I see a thing. I'm not going to try that. As much as I want to, I'm not going to try that. I'm sure you can make that jump around the corner, but I'm not going to. Well. One of these things I'll get up here. I'll get back up top. Also, I realized that whenever you said A and B, you meant for me to slide up the, uh, or whenever I was jumping up that, to do that to make it back up. Well, actually, wait a minute. Can I do this? Can I get up this way? Because getting up is apparently hard. No, I don't think I can. Maybe I can, but I'm just going to go this way and be safe. Because I don't want to waste too much time. I really don't. Come on. We got this. I'll wait for that to get all the way across, or nearly all the way across. Ooh. I don't know why, I just love the jumping in this game. That's why I just do it all the time. If this plan works, I'm gonna be so excited. That was not my plan to walk, jump into the wall and then just uh, fall off. Can I, I? I don't think I can grab that. I need to stop being so impatient and just wait on these. I wonder if anybody knows what my plan is. It's pretty obvious because I'm looking at it right now. I don't think I can make that jump. I want to try though. It doesn't help that the camera is just moving on its own. 
I feel like I could have possibly made that. I just didn't get the angle right. Wait, if I do this... Would that work? Would it actually... Hmm... I want to try that one more time. And then we're going to go for the, uh... Red coins. I really think I can make that. So we never read this one. Caution, air bridge cross slowly. You can jump to the edge of the cliff and hang on. And if you can climb off the edge, it will, if you move slowly, yeah. When you want to let go, press either Z or press the control stick in Mario's direction, the direction of Mario's back. To climb up, press up on the control stick. To scurry up quickly, press the A button. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I think I can make that jump. And I really want to. I really hope this works. Alright. Final attempt. Let's see. It's directly ahead of me. Dang it. I thought I could make it in. But hey, we had some good attempts. We had a couple good attempts at least. Let's get our coin star. And finally our a um our, our finally our red coin star. Words are hard. Break open the blue coin block by pounding the ground with the Z button. One blue coin is worth five yellow coins. But you have to hurry. The coins will disappear if you're not quick to collect them too bad. If you're not quick to collect them too bad. Really? I may do that. Actually, I don't know if I'm going to do that. I wanted to see if I could do it from the way I did. But since I can't... I would like to at least show, play with the owl. I'll give the owl like an attempt or two. I was just trying to figure out if there was a different way to get up there besides the normal ways. To be fair, I didn't even realize you could do that. Hold on. Sorry about that. I had to sneeze. Oof. Come on, give me that coin. Thank you. I was hoping I could just land on you while you were asleep. There we go. Like, I, I think that's where I started to say it. Uh, I have never actually gotten in that without the L. I didn't even know you could actually use the green platforms. Or, yeah, the green platforms. You said one of the corners. Haven't tried that yet. Oh god. Not there. There we go. Oh! That's a nice little warp. Thank you for that. Even if it took me forever to get there. Thank you, I do appreciate that. Have fun. And thank you for stopping by my half. I really appreciated it. Climbing's easy. When you jump up trees, poles, or pillars, you'll grab them automatically. Press A to jump off backwards. To rotate around the object, press right or left on the control stick. When you reach the top, press up to do a handstand. Jump off from the handstand for a high silent dismount. Wait, what? Really? So, I might try that now. Right, you know what, I will try it. Observation platform, press C up to take a look around. Don't miss anything. Press R to switch to Mario's camera. It always follows Mario. Press R again to switch Slack to his camera. Pause the game and switch the mode to fix the camera in place while holding R. Give it a try. 
I will still use the owl, but I'll use the owl to at least get up there. And then we'll see if I can jump into the cage. Also... Jeez, I didn't realize we were only at three. Wait, is that? Yeah, three. I didn't realize we were only at three of those. We already got his blue coin, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Let's get the- oh god. I'm trying my best. I didn't mean to crawl. I know where one is. I think there's some, some more at the top. Actually, I know where two are, I think. Maybe. I don't remember where they all are off the top of my head. Also, this is going to be very, very stupid. Maybe it won't be stupid. There we go. It could have been stupid. You've collected 100 coins. Mario games more power from the castle. Do you want to save? Yes. Oh god. Now we just gotta figure out where the other red coins are. How many do we have? We have six. We just need two more. And I'm pretty sure they're up here. Somewhere. We just gotta get to them. That did scare me a little bit. I thought I was going to fall off. What happened? Oh god. I almost fell off. Hmm. Aha. So let's see. We have to do, like, this right here. Ah, oh, crap. You have to do this jump when you run in the opposite direction. And then wall jump from the basket, and then press B in the air to kick and move to get back into the basket. I think I can do that. I honestly think I can. I'm gonna use this to get up there. Who's there? Who woke me up? It's still daylight. I should be sleeping. Hey, as long as I'm awake, why not take a short flight with me? Press and hold A to grab on. Release A to let go. I'll take you wherever you want to go as long as my wings hold out. Watch my shadow and grab on. Come on, I wanna grab you. I'm gonna fly up and try to land on one of the green platforms. And then we'll see if I can do this. There we go. Hmm. Why does it feel like the green platform is higher this time? Oh god. I had a little bit of trouble there. Okay. I hope I can get it. I'm gonna try it two more times at least. And then I'll go in it the normal way. Also, am I mistaken or wouldn't it be faster to just land in it? I don't know why it's like getting really slow. I don't know how to get the kick to work. I just dive. Do I hold back? I don't know. I'll try this one more time though. I'm having trouble getting the kick off. Got a wall jump and kick. If 
probably not the best way to do that, but... I missed that completely. Dang it. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to land in it. I'm sure I could get it with some practice. But I just, I don't know. Because I just do the dive. Really? Hold on, let me do this. I didn't touch the control stick that time. After the uh, ball kick, that is. Let's see. He actually pulled that. Oh god. I don't know. I'm having a little bit of trouble with it. Maybe if I figure it out, we can come back and try it again. Just for fun to see if I can do it. But yeah. I, at the moment, I don't know how to do it. But if I do figure it out, I'll be more than happy to come back and try it out again. Because I don't mind doing that, because I enjoy figuring out things like that. I like trying to do things like that too. Oh god. So we actually need the cannon here. Actually, there's a way to get that star. Hi, I'll prepare the cannon for you. But I don't know exactly how to get this star without using the cannon. Ready for blast off. Come on, hop into the cannon. Like, I know there's a way to do it, I just have no idea how to actually pull it off. I can't believe that actually hurts you. It's not very nice, but I mean, it makes sense. Oh god. That was a little too high. A little too high for little old me. I'm going to get up here and see. Actually, no, I'm not going to. I'm just going to fire into this and get it to open up. We'll make sure to get it. I think I would have actually hit the star if I would have done it from there. Yeah, I'm just going to play it safe and not kill myself this time. Ow. You butt. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Dang it. Dang, I thought maybe I could do that. No, I'm not trying that. That's gonna take forever. I'm impatient. Let's see, let's do this. There we go. Perfect. I did that a lot better this time. For me, at least. I'm sure others could have done it a lot better, but... I... I'm not them. That's what Toad has to say. What are you doing down here, buddy? It was Bowser who saw the stars. I saw him with my own eyes. He's hidden six stars in each course, but you won't find all of them in some courses until you press the cap switches. The stars you found will show you each course's starting screen. If you want to see some of the enemies you've already defeated, select the stars you recovered from them. Ugh. One of these days I'll learn how to read properly. Sometimes you'll bump into invisible walls at the edge of paintings, as the painting worlds. If you hit a wall while flying, you'll bounce back. Who even does that? Welcome back. We finished Flop's Fortress. Which, I mean, it wasn't too bad. Also, there's an extra life up here. Why didn't I come up here last time? Whenever I uh, had, like, no lives. 
Are you using the cat blocks? You really should, you know. To make them solid so you can break them, you, you have to press the colored cap switches in the castle's hidden courses. You'll find the hidden courses only after you gain some of the power stars. The cat blocks are a big help. Red for the wing cap, green for the metal cap, and blue for the vanish cap. We've already talked to that toad. Let's go in here and do this little secret thingy. And then we'll go to the actual uh, Jolly Rogers Bay and do all the stars there. This music is so wonderful. I never can get over how good this music is. I really appreciate it. Am I hilarious in a good way? Or am I hilarious as in, oh god, I can't believe he does some of the stuff he does. Or is it a combination of both? I do appreciate it, even if I don't feel like I'm entertaining half the time. To be fair though, I am my own worst critic. Because it's how I've always been. <laughs> but I'm glad you do enjoy it. It makes us all worth it. There's that motorcycle again. I don't know whose that is. But I don't ever hear a motorcycle until today. I'm sorry if it's too loud. We're doing really well on the Castle Secret Stars. Yeah, we got five out of 15. And yes, a lot of the music in this game is absolutely wonderful. Attention, read before diving in. If you stay under the water for too long, you'll run out of oxygen. Or return to the surface for air, or find an air bubble, or coins to breathe while underwater. Press A to swim. Hold A to swim slow and steady. Tap A with smooth timing to gain speed. Press up on the control stick and press A to dive. You're not wrong. Hold down and press A while on the surface near the edge of the water to jump out. A is always... A. Getting out of the water is always the hardest thing to do. For me in this game at least. Also, like, like I said a minute ago, all the music... Like, well, you said first, but... The music in this game is fantastic, but I just absolutely love this track. It's so good. Also, I went up there to get the cannons ready, but I guess I can't do that yet. I love that you can grab the turtle shells underwater. Ah, keep leaving that ramp. I I love that, but I hate how fast it runs out. At least whenever you're underwater with the shells. I don't remember exactly what you have to do to get the eel to come out to play. But I know what happened last, or what worked last time. I'm gonna go rub his face. Come here. You know you wanna come out. You wanna come out and play with little old Mario. Because uh, Mario is your best buddy, and there's nothing in that ship that you need. Yeah, thank you, little little buddy. I'm so glad you let me into your home, so I can steal your treasure. I wonder if I remember the exact order for this. I think it's this one right here in the back, and then you go in order from left to right. I did not get that bubble. But I think I know the order of this, so I should be good. If I can touch it. Can I get the bubble? There we go. Who? Really? I actually didn't know that. I did not know that was supposed to be a thing. But I'm glad that they didn't do that, because uh, that means you can actually get health back a lot easier. 
since you share your health and oxygen on the same meter. At least I think that's why you get health back. That is really nice though. That it's not in the game. But it would be interesting to see what that would be like. I'm gonna try to see if I can activate the cannon now. Cause it'd be nice to have the cannons ready to go. There it is. Wait, was he actually here and I just missed him? Last time? Cause I could see that happening. Climbing's easy. When you jump at trees, poles, or pillars, you'll grab them automatically. Press A to jump off backwards. We've already read this. Cause I guess I don't expect you to go in order, which is actually really good. Hi, I'll prepare the cannon for you. It's really nice that they don't do that. Because, uh... People aren't always going to play in order. I mean, we've played sort of mostly in order. So far. With the exception of going to Cool Cool Mountain and finishing that before anything else. But, uh... Not everybody's going to do that. Somebody might just grab one star from the first level, or three from the first level, and then say, you know what, I want to go to uh, Jolly Roger Bay. Or, is that what it's called? Yeah, Jolly Roger Bay. Oh god. I can do this. Uh, is it Beta64? I've seen his videos before if it's him. I don't know who it, who it is though. I I need to get in that center. I can do this again. I've done it once. I can do it again. I thought so. I don't remember that video though. To be fair, I don't watch all of his videos. I need to watch more. I just don't get enough time. Come on, Mario. I know I need to get in the center. But I'm like, I have so much trouble staying in the center. I'm gonna try this one more time and then we'll get to the star we're supposed to get. I really wanna be able to get that without the use of the uh, metal cap. I can. But I did it last time, and I'm like, I want to do it again. If I have to, though, I will come back with the metal cap. I just... I really want to be able to do this. Come on. Dang, I, was so, I think I almost had it, and I messed up on the pressing of A. Sorry about that. I moved my leg up in the seat. Well, onto the seat. And it made a weird noise because was, it was up against the recliner. I don't know if that picked up on the mic, but it might have. Come on. Dang it. I'm gonna try it one more time before getting the, the star spice too. I might have already said that, but I'm stubborn. Thank you. Also, I, it helps that I'm stubborn. It helps that I'm very, very stubborn. Dang it, I feel like I get it, the timing right, until I get down to it, and then I mess up a little bit. I think I gotta wait until the animation is finished, before hitting A again. Like this.
I almost feel like if we had the turtle shell, we could do this. I feel like I'm making progress right now. Dang it. Okay. I think I can make it. Dang it, I feel like I was right beside it. I don't know exactly. I don't remember how I did it last time. I think I came at it from kind of from the top, but also from the side. I'm not 100% sure on this. Because I've only done this one time. Also, I know I said one more time and I'm still just going. But I'm just like, I think I can do this. Dang it. I feel like I'm making a little bit of progress. Dang it, then I feel like I get pushed back. I'm just gonna go. I'm going for it. I know what's going on with that beeper, but I'm, I'm gonna try it. I wanna use this as the real like. I'll come back after this next star. I, I feel like I'm, I was getting close. I honestly feel like I was getting close. We'll go ahead and get the the ill star. I honestly feel like I was getting close. To be fair, last time whenever I actually got it, I was like, I didn't even feel like I was that close to it whenever I grabbed it. It's tempting because that star is right now. But we'll go for the eel first. You know you want to come out. You know you want to come out. Yeah. Give me that tail. Give me that tail. Ow. Oh god, give me that breath. Give me that air. Maybe. It might be possible that's the case. I don't know the exact way that works. I just know it's a thing. And I always tried it as a kid. And always failed at it. To be fair, I was learning and getting better. But uh, I didn't see it ever actually happen until Lowry was playing it. She actually got it and I was just like, what? I've tried this for years, how do you do this? And I think she just went in straight from the top. If I'm not mistaken. Oh god, how did he not hit me? Give me that star. Dang it, I didn't hit it. Dang it, that star is just like spooky. I feel like I'm not making any, there it goes. Whew. I didn't feel like I was getting close to that. But hey, we got it. We're gonna get that star. I know we are. I know we can get it. I've done it once. I can do it again. Whoops, I didn't mean to turn around the backflip. Treasure of the Ocean Cave. Hello, Mando. 
I hope you're having some good food. Actually, did I say hello or did I say welcome back? Welcome back. Just in case. Give me this magical star. Dang it. I feel like the current is actually stronger the farther down you go. Dang it. I'm gonna grab these coins and I'm gonna try just a little bit more. And then we'll go do the other one. I promise I will not do this like I did earlier. Where I just kept trying. Wish I could see it. There we go. Now if only I can get close. I feel like my nose is touching it. Dang it. I thought my nose was touching it. I'm, I'm sorry, I am stubborn. I am very, very, very stubborn. I felt like my nose was touching it and Mario was like, no. Or the game was like, no, you don't touch this. This is not for you. Step away from the star. I am so close. I am not going to stop. Okay, I'm going to stop. Wait, wait, wait. I know you're here. I'll just go this way. Well, haha, -ha, I didn't die. I beat the game. I I didn't beat it, but yeah. Keep out, that means you. Arr. Anyone entering this cave without permission will meet certain disaster. Well, ow. We're gonna have to try it again because I'm a butt and I'm stubborn. Ow. I sort of knew the order. Oh, I thought it was going to be somewhere else. Crap. I thought I had it. We're getting that star. If it's the last thing I do. I don't care how much of a butt that star is, but we're getting it. Actually, this is going to be a long attempt for a star no matter what. You know, I wasn't expecting to hit that or slide off of it. Give me the star. <laughs> Oh god, I hope it doesn't take 10 years. Ten years later. Dang it. I'm, I can do this. I believe in myself enough that I can get this
Dang it. I feel like I did better whenever the camera was on my butt. I'm not gonna make it out. This is death. Or I can make it. Oh. I got this. I don't know how I didn't die there, honestly. Dang it. I thought I had it. Camera, go down. I feel like I'm so close. I feel like I was just like arm's length away. I'm, I'm getting closer, I think. I hope I'm getting closer. All right, one or two more tries and then we're going for the star, the stars, the coins. To be fair, the coins have stars in them. Or on them, not inside them. I don't need the metal cap. The metal cap would be helpful, but I don't need it. Dang it. I am so sorry for being this stubborn. But I believe in myself enough to get this. Dang it. Come on, Mario. Come on, Mario. Touch it. You're not going to touch it. Not now, at least. Damn it. I'm going to die. Dang it. I was so close. I thought I was so close, at least. Ah. We can do this. I am trying this again. I feel like that was my closest attempt. And then, as stubborn as I am, if I don't get it this time, I'll just go get the metal cap. I'll immediately go get the metal cap before anything else. And just get it and be done with it. I may need it, but I got it before without it. I'm doing it again. Or I'm hopefully going to do it again. Dang it. Come on, Mario, I believe that you can swim. You've done this before. Damn. Can't, I can't believe you have so little faith in me. I've done it before, damn it. I can do it again. Uh, I'll be here for a long time trying this, knowing how stubborn I am. I don't know how I got it that one time. I won't... <laughs> I feel like half the stream is just going to be me doing this.
My half saw me do this. At least I think he did. I think he was here for that. Dang it, I keep getting so close. And then I just fail so hard. All right, all right. I'll go for the coins. I'll go for the coins. Give me these. And then after I get the coins, I'm gonna try it again. Probably. This is gonna make me go insane. Cause I know I can do it. I've done it before. Once. Only one time. But I can do it. I mean... Stubbornness is a good thing, but it can also be bad. It can be very, very bad. Ahoy, matey. I have sucking treasure here, I do. But to pluck the plunder, you must open the treasure chest in the right order. What order is that, you say? I'll never tell. Cap'n. Let's try this again. If I didn't get the star yet. The coin star, that is. I'm just gonna do one quick little attempt. The second I get pushed out completely, I'll uh, just go for that red coin over there. Dang it, I got pushed out. Alright, let's go. Give me that red coin. I think the rest of them are up here. I don't think there's any more down at the very bottom. At least, I hope not. Why did it look like it moved there? Like it got all wavy. Or my mind's playing tricks on me because I'm going crazy from the uh, one star. I think it's my mind playing tricks on me because I'm going crazy from the one star. Also, there it is. I was like, where's the clam at? Ow. You jerk. I still, I still think I can do it. There's a part of me that's just like, go back. Go back and do it now. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna get the star out of the way first. Get the red coins too. The red coin star that is. It's not over though. I do want it. I want to get it that way. I feel like I haven't actually obtained it if I get it with the uh, metal cap. Because that feels like the easy way out. I've always been that way too. I always, I always make things harder on myself, just because I feel like it's more fun for me at least. Oh god, that's the way I've always been though. Come on, give me those coins. Crap, I didn't mean to fall. Well, I guess if we fail, might as well go it. No. I'm not doing that with 98 coins on me. We will see what happens. Yeah. 
I think I'm I'm gonna try it some more, I know I am. Hi Lowry, how are you today? I can't do it. I can't get that star again. You've recovered 30 power stars. Now you can open the big door with the, the big star. But before you move on, how's it going otherwise? I'm fantastic. How did your stream go? Did you pound the two columns down? You didn't lose your hat, did you? If you did, you had to stop that condor to get it back. They say that Bowser has sneaked out of the sea and into the underground. Have you finally cornered him? Oh god. I was expecting to hit that. We'll see if I can get it. I'm gonna try to swim again. Oh. Do you remember how you did it? Because I don't remember the exact positioning. Like, at all. Also, I don't know if you did. I need to probably check that. Give me one second. Swim good. I will try to swim good. I am not the best at that. As you know. Also, hello, Lowry. Wait, why did I say hello? Thank you for hosting me. Hello, Tarback. How are you today? What are you doing? I actually had to check to see if you hosted me or not. <laughs> and my first thought was to say hello. Don't mind me. I'm a dummy sometimes. Wait, what is this star? Blast to the stone pillar. I don't want to blast to the stone pillar yet. I want to grab that star. I don't know how to grab. I did it once. And I can't do it today for some reason. Oh god, camera please. I felt like I got closer with this camera. Maybe it's just because the camera's closer to it. I can't swim good. Ah. Tarback, thank you for following. I really appreciate it. I'm struggling so hard right now, but thank you. Urgh. I'm gonna try this one more time. And as much as I hate to admit it, if I don't get it this time, I'm probably just gonna get the metal cap. I don't know if I can get this again. I think that was a one and one one time thing for me. I mean, it probably wasn't, but I've been, I've been struggling so much trying to grab this. This is probably like my fiftieth attempt. I was right there. <laughs> You're not wrong. Did I mention? That I'm stubborn. Because I believe I brought that up many times. I know I am. I am just the absolute worst when it comes to that. And yes, I am trying again. I want to get some more attempts in. Wait, what am I doing? I need to swim in from the top. I can do this. Doesn't matter how hard it is. I I did it! I did it! Yeah! I told you I could do it. Even if I did go a little insane. I did it. It took 20 years. But I got it to happen again. That is true. Thank you for that, too. Oh, what? <laughs> well, alright then. 
I don't know where to go next. You know what? I think I'm gonna go fight Bowser next. And get the, uh... I'm gonna go ahead and fight Bowser and I'm gonna get the, uh, invisible cap. I gotta fight the teleporting Bowser. You know the best one. Also, I'm having a lot of trouble with this. I guess I'm not aiming high enough. Yeah, I did the ice level really early because I just wanted to play in the snow. I'm not even lying about that, I just wanted to play in the snow. Oh god, we almost fell off. Yeah. We've, uh... We finished Mom on Battlefield. We finished Jolly Roger Bay. We finished, uh... Cool Cool Mountain. We finished Womp's Fortress. We finished the Secret Slide. We finished Bowser. The first Bowser. And... The Wing Cap? Yeah, the Wing Cap. Uh... Hilary did it in a way I wasn't expecting, but I was like, I want to see how this goes. And it worked out. It worked out really well. Well, not really well, but it worked. Either way, it's something new that I didn't know you could do. And I, sound, I feel like a butt now for saying that. Yeah, she actually landed on the platform. Which is like, how? Well, I am glad that, we, that I decided to go fight Bowser again. Because we get to listen to this music again. Which is so good! Don't mind me, I'm an idiot. No, but seriously, this music's fantastic. I saw a thing pop up on my phone and I was like, what? What is this? Who does that? I will say, are you prepared for me to fight Bowser for 30 minutes? I am. Who even knows how to throw Bowser? Oh! Well, I mean, I can't get out of the water. No! I did not know that. A ham sandwich makes the best music, apparently. It's fantastic. I wish I knew how to play the ham sandwich. Yeah, this place. Oh boy. Actually, you know what? As we do this, we should definitely get the uh, metal cap and the wing cap. Also, here goes me being impatient. <laughs> well. I'm gonna try that again. Here goes me being impatient. Oh god. Oh god. I thought I actually made that. Come on, let's go. Good, good. She's a wonderful streamer. So I don't blame you for following her. Oh god. I don't know why I said oh god there. Don't mind me. Aha! I wasn't sure if I could do that. 
I don't know what you're talking about. I'm okay at best. I hope you have some wonderful knobs. And I hope your lark is good. Oh god. Let me fall down. Ow. I was hoping I could land on all three of them. Actually, you know, can I do this? Yes, I can. Also, thank you for the good luck. I don't know if I mentioned that. Also, I gotta be fast here if I'm gonna spend 30 minutes in uh, Bowser's fight. Because, I mean, something has to be fast. Oh god. Doing a lot better than I thought I would in this course. Based on how I just play. Yeah, it's a red coin. Give it to me. Is it a red coin? Yes, it is. Also, I don't know if I asked. How are you doing today, Tarback? Are you learning how to play the ham sandwich? The best, the best instrument in the world? Oh god, what am I doing? Oh god, oh no. Oh god, that was close. Oof. That was a lot spookier than I was expecting it to be. Well. <laughs> I didn't know that. I would like to hear some of this wonderful music at some point. I don't know how I managed to do that. I should probably pick up that life if I'm gonna do stupid stuff like this. Oh god! Oh crap, what am I doing? Dang it. Maybe I'm going to spend 30 minutes in this course before the fight. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Who even waits like, they, like they're supposed to? Don't you dare bully me. Oh no! I, uh, meant to long jump there, but you saw how that turned out. I did try the Alice, but I couldn't do it. I did, however, spend like 20 minutes trying to swim into that one star again underwater again. I don't know why I said swim and underwater, because you knew exactly what star I was talking about. But yeah, I struggled on that. I got it to work. We have completed the first floor, pretty much. We haven't done the Boo's Mansion yet. We'll be doing that soon, though. I wanted to at least get this Bowser out of the way. And I'm gonna go to Hazy Maze Cave and get the Metal Cap. And then we're gonna go pick up the uh, Invisible Cap and then we'll probably go to Boo's mansion. Oh god. But yeah, we're doing pretty good right now. I think we are at least. I did eventually get it. But uh, it took a long, long time. I honestly think it took 20 minutes before I got it. My stubbornness finally paid off. Which is good for me, at least. I'm actually kind of glad that caught me. That's not too bad, actually.
Ow. Oof. Now can I actually get that star? Actually, I want to go this way because I feel like this is a bit easier. A bit safer too. I think I might have to wait a few seconds. Yeah. There we go. Easy peasy. Whoa! I don't know why I said whoa. Wow, another power star. Mario games, more courage than the power of the castle. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like I've done a pretty good job. I mean, we're at 35 stars already. Now for me to just not toss Bowser into anything. Pestering me again, are you, Mario? Can't you see that I'm having a merry little time? Making mischief with my minions? Now I turn those stars. My troops in the walls need them. <laughs> Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh god. You know this isn't lemon squeezy. Well. I definitely will have trouble here. I can guarantee I will not get this in the first attempt. Bowser, just let me get around you. Just let me grab your tail. That's all I want in life is your tail. Well, I guess I can do that. I would love it if it was that easy. Dang it. If only I got that first try. No, no. Well, we're closer to it this time. We're a lot closer. There we go. That was easy. Oh, can it be that I've lost? The power of the stars has failed me this time. Consider this a draw. Next time, I'll be in perfect condition. I got him second shot. Now, if you want to see your precious princess, come to the top of the tower. I'll be waiting. <laughs> we did it. Now, let's go get those metal caps. Oh, those metal... the caps. The caps will be very, very, very nice. Let's see. We only need the Vanish Cap for the next area, which I believe is the uh, ghost place, right? The mansion. The Boo's Mansion. Jeez. At first shot. I've never seen that movie. I've heard good things about it, but I've never seen it. Actually, I want this rabbit. I want the rabbit. There we go. Yeah. Yeah! Unhand me, brute! I'm late, so late. I must make haste. This shiny thing? Mine. It's mine. Finders, keepers, losers. Late, late, late. Ouch! Take it then. A gift from Bowser it was. Now let me be. I have a date. I cannot be late for tea. Easy peasy. I might one day. I've, like I said, I've always heard, um, I've always heard that it's fantastic. I've just never actually seen it. Wow, another power star. Mario games, more courage than the power of the castle. I would like to save. We're at 7 G's out of 15. I need to get up here. We can get the uh, metal cap from the first part, can't we? So many beasts in the cavern. Actually, I guess we can. Because we gotta go down there anyway. We're not gonna be able to get the star though, I don't think. No, we won't be able to. Oh. That's a bit closer than I wanted it to be. Never realized what was there. Oh, the reference? I didn't realize that either when I was a kid. 
And I actually, I don't think I realized it whenever I was playing it most recently as an adult. Well, at least there's water down here to get health back. Alice in Wonderland was a good movie. I remember enjoying it. Um, where's this beast? Where's Dory? I think that's what it's called. Let's go this way. Come on. Let's go. I believe in you. The uh, reference to Alice in Wonderland from the bunny whenever you catch it. It's... It's... Talking about how it's light and everything. I, uh... I, I did watch Alice in Wonderland. But it's been a while and I don't remember much about it. Welcome to the metal cap switch course. Once you step on the cap switch, the green blocks will become solid. When you turn your body into metal with the metal cap, you can walk underwater. Try it. I love the metal cap music. I can't read. Hi, Mystic. How are you today? Metal Cavern. Right to the waterfall, left to the metal cap switch. But yeah, how are you doing today? I hope you're having a wonderful day so far. Oh god. Nope. Oh god. Okay, at least that's there to catch me. Also, I see Mystical and I just think uh, Mystical Ninja. But I've had that game on my mind for a while now. I really want to play it again. Give me that button. You've just stepped on the metal cap switch. The metal cap makes Mario invincible. Now metal caps will pop out of all the green blocks you find. What do you got to say? Of course. I'm having a wonderful day. Thank you for asking. And I'm glad you're having a great day. I'm just, uh... Trying my best to get all the stars in this game. And I'm very, very stubborn. I could have had a lot more by now. But I want I just to make things harder on myself. To be fair, it's more fun that way to me. Where is the last red coin? Did I pass by it? I mean, I had to have passed by it. Oh god, camera. Green block, uh, cape feathers. Mario, um, Super Mario World. I played that recently. That was so fun to go back and play through that again. Super Mario World is just absolutely fantastic. I have nothing but love for that game. Hmm. Where, oh, where is this last red coin? I am honestly confused and fuzzled. It's gotta be around here. Oh, there it is. I didn't realize there was this little gap right here. Oh well. Oh god, I need to run around this way. I was kind of scared that that might run out. Even though it wasn't flashing yet. One of the castle's secret stars. You know, I think we can get 50 today. Hold on to your hat. If you lose it, you'll be injured easily. If you do lose your cap, you'll have to find it in the course where you lost it. Oh boy, it's not looking good for Peach. She's still trapped somewhere inside the walls. Please, Mario, you have to help her. Did you know that there are enemy worlds inside the walls? Yep, it's true. Bowser's troops are there too. Oh, here, take this. I've been keeping it for you. Bamboozled. Heckin' bamboozled all over again. I'm glad that everybody around here is nice and thank you. I hope everybody that comes here ends up being really nice. Because it's more fun. Well, another power star. Mario gains that you're more courage from the power of the castle. Thank you again. I do appreciate it. 
But yeah, everybody around here is really nice. And it makes me happy. I gotta get that invisible shroom now. Inv shroom? The invisible cap. Jeez. So bad at this sometimes. Not bad, I'm just forgetful. Ow. Wait, did that actually hurt me? There we go. I always have trouble getting out of the water. I'm, I'm sure I'm not the only one, though. I think this just gives you a hint. It is decreed that one shall pay on the pillars. Yes. Also, it's going to be nice being able to have all the hats. Because that means we can just complete every level as we go to them. Welcome to the Vanish Cap Switch course. All of the blue blocks you find will become solid once you hit step on the cap switch. You'll disappear when you put on the Vanish Cap so you'll be able to elude enemies and walk through many things. Try it out. Did we talk about catch The USB adapters? I think we did. But... Like I said before, my memory is kind of bad. I'm pretty sure we did talk about that though. Oh god. I'm gonna slide in just a second. Ooh, not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. This level gives you a lot of lives. Which is really nice. There we go. The Vanus Calf level is pretty good. I just hope I don't screw up too bad. Because I can see myself not doing too well here. Because I do like to mess around a lot. There we go. Now the scariest part. These aren't too bad because they're not flipping. But the ones that flip are kind of terrifying, honestly. Oh god. There we go. Okay, so... I thought that flipped. Or they flipped at the top. They must flip at the top. At least I would think so. Ow. Ah, uh, there it is. I got a little worried about that. Also, I think the last one's up here. Oh god! Jesus. That scared the crap out of me. You just stepped on the Vanish Cap switch. The Vanish Cap makes Mario disappear. Now Vanish Caps will pop from all the blue blocks you find. With the outside, of course. That honestly scared the crap out of me. I wasn't expecting to land back on the platform. Those adapters. I'm trying to like I'm trying to think of what exactly we talked about. I don't remember when that was. Was that during Paper Mario? I think it was at least. But I'm not 100% sure and I just banged my head against the wall. Oh, okay. Oh, is it? That's good to hear. Uh, so you stream, right? Or do you just record videos? Okay. If you stream, I might have to check you out. Because I'm sure it'd be fun. Plus, I wouldn't mind seeing how good this is. Or the adapter is. I'm gonna have to follow you. I'll do that as soon as the stream ends. Ah. Come on in here. Heh heh heh. This level is easy for the uh, 100 coins, if I'm not mistaken. You don't stand a ghost of a chance in this house. If you walk out of here, you deserve a ghoul medal. Ah. Uh, even though I do stream, I don't think I'm the best person to ask. Because, uh, I literally, my catch card, I just hook it up and hit stream. But, uh, I know other people have said that they had to use, uh, OBS and stuff, and I don't know anything about that. 
And I don't know if you would have to use that or not. The vanish cap is inside the blue block. Mr. I will be surprised, since he'll be invisible when you wear it. Even the big boo will be fooled, and you can walk through the secret walls too. I can understand that too, my half. I was like that for a while. I'm just glad I can do it now. Because it's a lot of fun. And I hope that you do get a chance to at some point. Because it is fun. Oh god. These chairs are butts. I think this we just have to take out the uh, boos. Wait a minute. I just skipped two boos. Ghost, don't die. <laughs> can you get out of here alive? I'd like to think I can. But we'll see. We just gotta hear them say that multiple times. Actually, oh. Ghosts, don't die. <laughs> can you get out of here alive? Ghosts, don't die. <laughs> can you get out of here alive? I do that too sometimes. Because I always, like, I'll either, like, just watch the stream and interact a lot, or I'll play games and interact a little bit. I'm sure you could get one for really cheap, Mystic. I think if you have any retro game stores near you, you should be able to pick one up for around $20, $25. But then again, I don't know if money's an issue or not. Because if it is, I can understand that too. Oh crap, the Tower of Terror, the Big Boo. Ka ha ha ha. I missed some dialogue. Uh, N64 should be that cheap. If I'm not mistaken. That's like not counting eBay prices or anything. I don't know what eBay would have for the N64. Hold on. Uh, well, of course it'd be used. And that's probably one of the reasons why I'd be so low. I'm gonna check real quick. Hello, Potato. How are you doing today? This isn't like a... This is a site that that shows like around what the prices are for games and consoles. Some stores will like sell less, some stores will sell higher. It all just depends on where you go. But I believe the N64 is kind of cheap. Oh god. I was wrong. PlayStation 1 is cheap, because I got one recently, and the original Xbox is cheap, because I got one recently. It's around $50, if not a little bit more. Really? That's awful. Uh, my local store, they actually seem to go based off this, this site. It's like video game price charting. They, uh usually go a little bit cheaper than what retail is usually at. Thankfully. But the bad thing is they don't usually have a lot of stuff in because people will go in and be like, alright, this the prices are good. Let's buy it. Also, Potato, thank you for following me. Ah. Uh, I can see how that would be different. Oh god. What is this music? I've, I always hear this and I, it sounds familiar like I've heard something similar before somewhere. But I'm not exactly sure where. Also, you know what? Let's go ahead and get the uh, coin star while we're here. Oh god. I don't know about Amazon. I've never actually ordered anything from Amazon.
I didn't. I honestly didn't realize that. I thought for sure that it would have been a lot cheaper than that. But then again, it is a Nintendo product. Hell, I even got my uh, GameCube for twenty-five dollars recently. Thankfully, I had my N64, my old N N64. Really? That's kind of insane. Give me those coins. I will say I love that this level has so many blue coins. It makes things so much easier. Ow. If I can read the sign. The Vanish Cap is inside. The blue block. Mr. I will be surprised that she'll be invisible when you wear it. Oh wait, we already did that. I do too. I don't have a Switch yet. But my friends that have it are always complaining about the virtual console. And it seems so weird that they wouldn't already have that. Because that seems like something that should be... A, like, that should have came out with the launch, or close to launch. Running around in circles makes some bad guys roll their eyes. But yeah, that always seemed really weird to me. You would think that the virtual console would have been the, one of the first things up. I luckily kept a lot of my older stuff, but whenever I did sell games, I sold PS2, Xbox, and GameCube and stuff. And I wish I never sold any of that. I wish I had all that old stuff back. Same, I wouldn't get rid of my SNES or N64. To be fair, I wouldn't get rid of any of my stuff at this point. It. It is a weird complaint, but here's the thing. Some of those old games can be really expensive as carts or CDs, like if you want them physically. But, like, if you never had a chance to play them as a kid, but it's something you would like to play, like, say, Earthbound? I would much rather have the virtual console up so you could have a chance to play that again. Actually, that's on SNES Classic, but still. <laughs> the booths are super shy. If you look them in the eyes, they fade away. But if you turn to your back, they reappear. It's no use trying to hit them when they're fading away and said sneak up behind them and punch. But yeah. There's always a chance that somebody wants to play some of those older games that they can't play because they weren't alive at the time. Or it's just so expensive now that it's hard to get. So I can understand wanting the virtual console. I don't know if it was or not. I don't know too much about Earthbound, other than I would love to play it at some point. Alright. I hope you can get one soon. And thank you for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Also, thank you for following again. I really appreciate that too. Now, what, what was I doing? I lost track of what I was actually doing. I never played Magic or any of those card games. I They look fun to me. But I get sucked into things too much. One of them release, release some Potato Land. Potato Land sounds like a good place. Also, there's, oh, there's a red coin in here. Yeah. Jesus, that does a lot more damage than I expected it to. Oh god, please don't hit me. Give me all your red coins. Oh god. I do like potatoes, though, so Potato Land immediately sounds like a good place. Just... Oh, wait, I thought he was locked onto me. Mr. I, please look at me. Thank you.
Okay, I'm trying to like read and run through the door and I'm having trouble getting through the door. I've always, like, I've had interest in it, but I know I couldn't do it without just getting sucked in and being like, I have to buy like a million cards. Because that's how I've always been. You butt. Oh god. I didn't mean to jump down here. Dang it. We gotta get back up there and get that those coins. If we get those coins, we'll just we'll just drop back down here and pick up the uh, star. No big deal. Really. I've had Burger King in forever. I don't know why. I just haven't had it. And I'm hungry too. But I can't eat yet. I got stars to collect. And if you're talking to me, I I don't have that kind of money to keep trying to collect games and collect cards at the same time. Sushi? I've only had sushi once. I loved it, but everybody else that was with me was like, ugh, this is awful, how can anybody like this? And I've never gotten a chance to eat it again. Oh god. To be fair, I don't really have that much money to even collect games, but I try to, dang it. I try to. I would love to, uh, at some point pick up Mario Sunshine and play it. And plus, I need to get a GameCube controller. Because the controller that came with my GameCube that I got, like, a couple months ago, the control stick doesn't work. You can't move forward or backwards. You can play anything that's a side scroller, but that's about it. You had ice cream? What kind of ice cream? They might have screamed from the bottom of their lungs. Maybe. I don't know. Possibly. A Nintendo DS Lite. I have a 3DS. And I have an original DS, I think. But I don't play my handhelds that much. I don't play them as much as I should. They're mostly just like, it's Pokemon machines. But there's a lot of stuff I do want to play on them. Like, uh, the Ocarina of Time remake. Link Between Worlds, Majora's Mask remake, which I have, I just haven't actually played yet. The Mario and Luigi games. I only play it whenever Light Power is out, honestly. Secret of the Haunted Books. Do we even need to worry about the Secret of the Haunted Books? I think we can actually make this. Dang it. I will say, as much, like, as little as I play them, they are still wonderful, fantastic consoles, or handhelds, whatever you want to call them. I think I can honestly make that jump. <laughs> I know, I'm not the best. I'm trying, dang it. I'm trying things. Ow. Did you really? Jesus, that's insane. Do you speed run the game? I I can't do that. Like I I don't think I could ever get that good. All right, I'll go, and I'll do the what start of the normal way. That's insane though. I don't know how. Anybody is that good? 
16 stars. Jeez. How do you get to Bowser if you do 16 stars? Like, I've seen a few speedruns, but I... I think they've all been, like... 70 star speedruns, maybe? I think that's right. I think that's those are the ones I've seen. But I know there's like a bunch of different categories for this game. Mips clip. I'll have to check that out at some point. Glitches fix everything. I believe it. I have seen th those are a thing too, and I'm just like, how? How are people this good? Some of those some of those speedruns are just insane for games. I think the most insane one I've ever seen is that uh, Super Mario World one, where uh, that where you can beat the game without getting any exits. Passing. Yeah, to assisted speedruns. Some of those are ridiculous. Or most of them are. I've always... Oh, I didn't realize those books would give you coins. I've always saw speedruns and they've always looked amazing. But I just... I, I don't think I could ever get that good. I love watching people that are that good though. It's always it's a lot of fun. Can I make this jump? Apparently not. I mean, I could probably make it if I tried it again, but I don't need to try it again. Really? I may have to watch them. I seriously may have to do that. Also, I gotta remember. I gotta follow Durbin after the stream. And I can check out your streams. Oh god. Let's see how this goes. I think there's a star over here. Yes, there is. Oh god, I almost fell off there. When you see the tool learning. What do you mean? I'm sure I would enjoy your streams. Mips seems amazing. Oh, you don't? Well, I'll have to check out your YouTube videos. I'll have to see these at some point. Oh god. You know, I wasn't expecting to land in the fire. I'll just walk out. Give me that jump. I need to get up here, honestly. I know there's two red coins in here. Oh god. How did I not get hit there? Well, I fixed it. Whisper me a link, because I don't. I think I have it set up where uh, you can't post links in the chat. And yeah, in the chat. I'm sorry, I'm a dummy. I couldn't even think of what chat was for a second. Give me that star. Also, I don't know how much longer we're actually gonna go. I said, I think I said four hours. At least, I don't know. But I'm really wanting to get some food. I think I'm going to finish this world, and we'll finish one more, and then I'm going to go get some food. That seems about, that seems good for me. 
really. I'll have to, I'll check that out too at some point. Dang it. If I could even get on this wall. As you can tell, I'm the best at wall jumping. There we go. This is, yeah, the big boo on the balcony. I didn't remember if this was the eye or what it was. I can't believe three of the stars here are for the same thing. It's uh, 4 p.m. for me. And I have not eaten in about like six hours now. Five, six, something like that. I'm a hungry boy. I am apparently not paying attention to what I'm doing either. But yeah, it's, it's about four o'clock. I should... I should probably honestly be eating by about 4.30. At least I think I will be. Give me, give me that little cage. Yes. I don't, I don't remember where I originally heard that from. But I do know that. I thought that was kind of cool. I mean, it is kind of cool. But it's like, I didn't know that till recently. Give me that hat. I gotta get this wall jump. I gotta get it down first try. Where I could do that. Did I just jump into the book? Come on, come on, Mario. Run, Mario, run. Oh, I can't believe I actually made that. Little Boo, please. Like I said, I'm gonna do at least one more world, and then I'm going to uh, end the stream. And whenever you do go to sleep, I hope you have a wonderful sleep. I forgot that you work uh, weird times on behalf. What time do you normally have to get up again? If you don't mind me asking. I'm trying to think, what is World 6? I think it's Lethal Lava Land. So we might as well go there. And do everything we can. We're about to get 50 stars, Jesus. Ooh, yeah. What is your record? If you know what it is. Wow, you've already recovered that many stars? Way to go, Mario. I bet you'll have us out of here in no time. Be careful, though. Bowser and his band wrote the book on bad. Reading's hard. Take my advice. When you need to recover from injuries, collect coins. Yellow coins refill one piece of the power meter. Red coins refill two, and blue coins refill five. To make blue coins appear, pound on blue coin blocks. Also, if you fall from high places, you'll minimize damage if you pound the ground as you land. Let's see. Okay. I'm glad you have tonight off. I need to get up around about 1 p.m. Alright. We'll see. That's the wrong level. Ah oh, well, we're already here. Don't be a pushover. If anyone tries to shove you around, push back. It's one on one with a fiery finish for the loser. It's lethal lava land. If you catch fire or fall into a pool of flames, you'll be hopping mad, but don't lose your cool. You can still control Mario, just try to keep calm. You can even keep calm whenever there's butts on fire. Ah. Uh -huh. 
Running around in circles makes some bad guys roll their eyes. Also, you say emulator. I thought... Uh, well, I guess it's, it's the personal record. It doesn't matter. But aren't emulators banned for speedrunning? Or am I mistaken? Hop on the shiny shell and ride wherever you want to. Go shred those enemies. I thought that was the case. I might be an idiot. Oh god. Oh god. I'm apparently struggling here. Let's see. Well, the big bully. Let's do this. Okay. I didn't know that. I thought I I just thought I remember seeing that somewhere. Come here, big bully. Get out of my ring. That is what I was thinking too. Honestly. But I'm sure some of them could like run exactly the same as the actual consoles. I guess. I don't know. Bullies of bullies. Really? Why do we have to bully the bullies? Why do I have to jump into the water? There's water. Lava. Water's bad. It burns. Hop on the shiny shell and ride wherever you want to. Wherever you want to go. Shred those enemies. But there's no turtle shell here. I guess we don't get it yet. Oh god, oh god, oh god, I'm dead. Dang it. I wish... I did not land in the water. In the water? Jesus! Why do I keep calling it water? And yes, the water around here is red. It tastes a little funny, but it's red. I'm sure it's fine, though. I mean, it has to be, right? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Dang it. I am not doing well right now. Jeez. That's insane. What enemies? I don't think I honestly have any enemies. The word enemies is apparently hard for me to say. Oh god, oh god. I am not doing well here. My butt is getting all toasted. Also, I'm not going to blame this on the controller. I could do better. I could work around it. The, uh... Control stick when I push forward. It, uh... That Mario... Well, any game, really. The, uh... Forward, I usually slow down a bit. Just based on how the control stick is. It's more noticeable in Paper Mario than it is in this. Wanna race on lo Lethal Lava Lava Land? Uh, I think I'd get my ass handed to me. I would not doubt that at all. So... Maybe. Oh. We can get the uh, coin star now. I mean, we could have gotten it any time, but 
Let's go ahead and get it now. Actually, no, because we I think we need to go into the uh, volcano. So let's wait until we can go into the volcano. Also, why is the uh, turtle shell not showing up yet? Ow. Are you serious? Dang it. That is insane. I can barely even speak my own language. As you can tell. Seriously. Oh god. Where's the uh, turtle shell? I want to ride around on it. I, I have no reply to how that even happened. I'm gonna go this way. I feel like I've done decent for the most part, for the most part, but yeah. Not, not now. I'm struggling so bad right now. I'm just gonna grab the star and go. Oh. That would have been nice for the coin star, but... I'm just taking that and getting out. Because, holy crap, I am struggling. Thank you. I do appreciate it. I'm screwing up a lot, though. Can I get this turtle shell now? I thought there was supposed to be a box here. But it's not spawning. Ah, oh, come on. I'm getting my butt all toasty again. Give me that coin. I do not want to... Well, <laughs> I tried to long jump. Oh, jeez. That could've been bad. Oh god. Nope. Nope. Oh crap, I was like, looking down at chat. Uh, oh god. I tried to read chat again. I, uh... I, I need to get better at my own English first. <laughs> Before I even think about another language. Maybe one day. So to be fair though, I would love to travel a bit more than I do. Like, I don't travel at all. And if I ever could, I would definitely want to learn the language of the place I'd be going to. Even if I had to relearn English like the 50th time. I do not like this fire. Please, just stop. Please stop. I don't want to be touched by the flames. This is not too bad. It could have been worse. It could have been a lot worse. Here we go. My sister... I don't know if she still knows French, but she learned French in high school, or college, one of the two. I learned a little bit of uh, Italian in school, but that's about it. You've recovered 50 power stars. Now you can open the star door on this third floor. Bowser's there, you know. Oh, you found all the cap switches, haven't you? Red, green, blue, the caps you get from the colored blocks are really helpful. Hurry along now, the third floor is just ahead. Bomb cap? A bomb clip? I don't know why I said cap. Uh, I don't know what that is, honestly. I wouldn't mind trying it, though. Because, I mean, why not? Where'd you go? Oh, crap.
There we go. Wait. <laughs> no, no, no. Not again. I'm in a great hurry, can't you see? I've got time. I have no time to squabble over stars. Here, have it. I never meant to hide it from you. I'll just, it's just that I'm in such a rush. That's it. That's all. Now I must be off. Ow, let me go. How do you do the bomb clip? Wow, another power star. Mario gains more courage from the power of the castle. Do you want to save? You bet. I can't believe we're already at 51 stars. Hot foot into the volcano. Okay. Ooh. There it is. Now I just need to make sure I don't run into anything. Oh god, camera. Oh, are you serious? Oh god. Oh, really? I don't know how to do that. I didn't know that was a thing. I will say... I did find out from... I did find out from Durbin that, uh... You can run around the poles to get money. And then I did that to the chain shop and got money. Somehow, some way. It's nice and it worked. Or is it my half? It was somebody. Oh god. My memory is bad and I'm sorry if I call out the wrong person for that. Let's see. Oh, I didn't know I could actually be underneath that, but okay. Give me all these coins. Hold on. Since this is really fast. Really? I didn't know that was a thing you could honestly do. That, uh... Oh god. This was a bad place for that to happen. Maybe not. I hope I got all the uh, coins that were in the lava at least. I think we should be good though for money. There's coins. I know all these little guys give away uh, coins. And I think we need at least 75 or 80 before we go into the volcano. But I'm going to try to pick up as much as I can. Because Mario 64 is a wonderful game. I love it. Oh god. Even if I'm not the best at it. Oh god, come on. You butts. Come on. You know what? There we go. Yeah. Alright. The thing that scares me is that box. Because that has a lot of money in it, but... I don't know how I'm supposed to actually get that without losing it. Yeah. I it was only and I only used it in high school. From oh god. So it was like as soon as I stopped going to the class, I forgot everything. No, you butt. My record for finishing the game. 
Probably like six sours. Seven, eight. Because, <laughs> yeah, I don't speedrun. I am, like, not the best at this. The one thing I have going for me, though, is I know how to get the stars. At least I think I know how to get them. But other than that, it's just like... I play it. Dang it. Well, this, this, this is butts. How could you do this to me? Well, actually, I think this is going to shoot out some coins for me. Yeah. I can see that. Like when I was a two-year-old? So, you mean last week? Oh god. Jesus. Definitely getting bullied by the bullies. I, I do wish that I was good enough at a game to do that. Now, I know it requires a lot of practice and it's not something you're just going to get good at overnight. But it's like, I wish I was better. Thank you again for stopping by Potato. I hope you have a wonderful day. And thank you for wishing me luck, because I will probably need it. I can't believe I actually made that. And then I just screwed it all up. Dang it. My... Prediction of 4.30 might not be too far off. Because I'm pretty sure that'll be about the time I finish this. And, uh... I'll go ahead and say this. Next time we play Mario 64 will be next week. Probably Wednesday. Honestly. Oh god, oh god, oh god, please. As long as I can just get all of the coins that are around lava, I'm happy. Alright, give me your blue coin, buddy. There are some coins up here I missed last time because I forgot about it. I'm just going to do this. This seems very easy. This seems like the best way to take care of the bullies, honestly. As long as the money doesn't just disappear. Aw, oh, crap. Let's see. Ow, my knee. I, uh, I think you're doing pretty good with your English Durbin. Like, I don't really see much of an issue with it, like, at all. You're really good with it. Oh, God. I am going to get my butt toasted soon, probably. Ooh, I think I'm gonna get the uh, money thing here. Yeah. Because the puzzle got solved. I mean, it's not a lot, but oh god. I think we're good. Dang it. If I can get this eye to give me money and I can actually grab it, I'm good. I should be fantastic. Yes, full health again. Ooh. I gotta ask, since you know so many languages, 
Does anything ever get mixed up? Or are you pretty good with that? Because I can see myself getting mixed up all the time. I could have got that box, crap. I'm pretty sure we have more than enough coins in here. At least I hope we do. Get over here, Mr. Bully. There we go. Really? I'm glad you don't get mixed up. Yeah, I just find it insane though that you know so many. And here I am over here just struggling with my own. Come on. Oh! I don't need to worry about that bomb. But some people are better at learning stuff like that than others. I wish I was better at it. Because it's always nice to be able to learn another language. You never know when it might come in handy. And whenever it does, like you go traveling, it's going to be really, really helpful. <laughs> Alright. We got one more star left. Dang it, I can't even do a backflip. I just immediately started crawling. I'll let her tour in the volcano. Oh yeah, I remember this star. This one should be easy peasy. Oh god. That could have been... That could have gone a lot worse. I don't think we'll have any trouble with this, but we might. Who knows? I could easily do something stupid and fall off this. Or I might just end up not paying attention whenever it drops. Because I know it does drop at some point. Oh, I didn't realize we had to jump for it to another one. There we go. Not too bad. Really. I hope it's something you enjoy. Well, I mean, I'm sure you do enjoy it if you've been doing it for a while. Ew, that could have been bad. That could have been real bad, honestly. Honestly, I should see. Wait. No, I don't leave. I should see after this if the uh, desert place is the next actual course. Because I do think that that'll be where I'm going no matter what. But I wonder if that's in the right order. Well, I mean, I know it's not in the right order technically because we already skipped the next one. But yeah. Ooh. Yeah, do you? I guess that could help too a lot watching streamers that uh, play a or streamers that just speak in different languages because it gives you more chance to use the languages you've already learned. I'm just gonna go in here and see what level this is or see what course number this is. Course eight. So I guess Hazy Maze Cave is uh, six. I'm still probably gonna do that next anyway. I'm gonna go get some food now. I wanna say thank you again to everybody that's been here talking. I really appreciate it. You guys have been a lot of fun to talk to. I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye everyone. I really enjoyed today. <laughs>